she was mighty purdy. <laughs> <laughs> the folks started talking about that November day. At the sing-along, we do it our own goddamn way. We sing for our rights and we sing for our lives. Some come lonely while others bring children and wives. <laughs> Kabriziak and Jam boys sitting proud in their chairs. I felt the spirit of Maisel, Lord, I swear he was there. One by one and slowly witnesses they were called. Jeff had tricks up his sleeve and Bob threw a curveball. <laughs> Steve Mayell, he can barely speak, he's not too bright. But Jason, he's smart, so when he's talking, keep quiet. Once in a while, I get lost staring into Julie's eyes. <laughs> get your mind back on track. I quickly realized <laughs> the bailiff looked like a guy who used to work at the Y. Turn off those cell phones at the ring, they become mine. A couple gals started snickering and they burst out a laugh. That didn't help our cause, <laughs> helped old Gabriziak. <laughs> Jason had the support of a mighty fine crew. It was clear that Mayel was thinking about bottles of glue. And then two of our comrades that were warm for their smiles. Use common sense, folks. This is Jason's jury trial. <laughs> One of the jurors dozed off and she started to snore. Holy Christ, this old dame didn't want to be there no more. <laughs> the jury sat silently doing their part. Come to think of it, we needed Jeff Rowan Bart. <laughs> this whole ordeal was about chalking, you see. We all know that chalking is protected speech. Judge Ches no more bringing up the First Amendment. <laughs> That was one thing she said, I certainly did resent. <laughs> Fighting Bob gave us all a soda gubriziac. Our hopes were all high, we had Huberty's back. The jury was quick to come with their verdict. Guilty was their call, it's time to chalk, no permit. <laughs>